Well, that's that. So I'm stopping at this place called the Toy Cantina, which is new to me. I never heard of you before. That's crazy. Wow. That's a big lots tag too. And some legos. Some pops. And they have an arcade here, which is all free. You can play anything you want. And they got some one-up arcades too. So how cool is that? Look at that. Oh. It's my first time seeing these guys. And this. Oh. Wow. Look at that. Really cool to see these things here too. There's Beast, a rogue. Is that Thor? Oh my god, it is Thor. And that's cool. How would I buy this just to have it side by side with my McFarlane? Wow. Toy box. some hot toys. And they got bins too. So who knows what could be in here.
Alright guys, let's see, could they have restocked? Oh, they did because they got this wave in, because there's Baron Zemo. Finally seeing this one in person in a Walmart. Do I need it? No, don't need it. But it's still empty, it's still very very empty. And I don't think it's going to go any further than what we see here. That's weird, where's the accessories for this? Oh, this is Coronation Starscream. So you're new, okay. But that's kind of weird that there's no accessories like, you know, how the accessories are placed there. Oh well, same there. They restocked with this, oh snap. Lady J, Cobra Commander, Snake Eyes, Cobra Commander. So I have all of these. And wrestling. Oh, collector's edition, comma and carrying cross. Nice. Three carrying crosses. So this is the new 85. Series. And I love that price, $15.97. So not bad. I don't need comma. I missed this. Look at that. There's the his tank. Three of them. Really cool. But not for me. I'm not buying these. Garbage trail kids, but look at that. Snake eyes, Baroness. Scarlet and Storm Shadow. Huh. And my god, there's SH Figuarts at a Walmart. What is going on? This is a great figure, too. Alright, guys, we're taking a look. Back at Target, they are completely remodeling this place. I mean, you can see. But mm -hmm. very hard. Matt Jackson. Huh. They got these back in, either that or they found them somewhere. I wonder if they're on clearance. And there's a little Vega. With a Restock of archive. Wow. Huge restock of archive. Moss Man, He Man. First time seeing He Man. It's not bad. Luckily, I'm not collecting. Wow. Stratos is here. Merman is here. Zodak is here. Not bad. And a battle damage. Along with other new stuff. And you're here, so let's check that out. And like I said, they are renovating. And yeah, they are like have old stuff. Look at that, that's old. I wonder if it's because they're unearthing stuff that's hidden under shelves. <laughs> that would be funny. That would be hilarious if they're doing that, considering this mess. Um, there's the two-pack. Here's Shriek. And see, see what I mean? This is what I'm talking about. Look at this. There's Roadblock, Lady J, Cobra Commander. The newer version of Roadblock, which I don't have, nor do I need it. So you can see the difference. But that's cool to see. We got that. Mask. Um, 
There's no Infinity Saga stuff and no legends to look at. But these are all restocks as well. Hmm. Okay. That might be it. It's Asher. No, I don't see any of the new stuff for him. Well, this is all new for him. And they still have this guy. Two of them. So the clearance aisle, we can take a look real quick. $2.99. My bad. And is there anything worth looking? I don't know. At least it's a little bit organized in the other store. But no, that's this is it. So the collectible section is in the clothing department for now. But look what they got. Yeah, not bad for restocking stuff. Homelanders back there. All of these. <laughs> Good lord, they probably started pricing stuff for the mere fact that it's like doing inventory all over again. Wow, that's new. Yep. There you go. Awesome figures. That's what I'm talking about. Who can make the most noise out here? One, two, three, make some noise. Hey, here you go, bro. That's for you. That's for you. We got more giveaways coming in just a little bit. So you got that guy right there. Is that Jason? What's up guys? Uh, it is an early Friday morning. It's probably almost 10 o'clock right now. Uh, I actually came to New Jersey because uh, my wife wanted me to run an errand because we're doing some kind of a consignment thing uh, for this event that is taking place. Uh, so I am at actually Eastern Mountain Sports because they're just giving away hangers and we need hangers for this event for all the clothing because you can't just have clothes folded or laid about you have to actually have them hung up so she got a message that they're just giving away hangers so i'm actually here gonna pick up hangers maybe we'll see uh but she said that since i'm going hit as many targets or whatever that you want so i'm like oh okay <laughs> if you want uh but uh since i am here in new jersey i'm actually by princeton uh, kind of near the Quaker Bridge Mall area on Route 1. So I'm going to check it out, see what's around. I know there's the target of Princeton that I can hit up where I hit up there last week. So we'll see. Uh, as far as it goes, let's hope we have a good hunt. I'm really looking for more of the Marvel Legends. Uh, maybe Wrecker. If I could find Wrecker, that would be cool. And of course, AEW Unmatched. Want to see where we can find that. I don't think there's any Walmarts around here. And the one that I went to last time was a crapshoot. So we'll see what happens. See you at the store. Oh, I told you. Hangers. I filled up the damn car. It's a lot. All right, so I'm back in Princeton. They got figure arts just laying around here. Top picks. Murphy, Ripley. Look at you and you. Awesome. Look at you. You're there. Awesome. else check this out i turned the corner and the lady just restocked series four 
So there's Sammy and there's Kenny. Oh, there's a Cody, Santana, and Ortiz. Oh my God. And of course, Matt Hardy. Awesome. So this target is in Monmouth Junction, which is 10 minutes down the street from Princeton. So let's take a look and see. And they're going through renovations too. Look at this. Guest service is over there. All right, guys. We're... Can we be lucky here? Maybe. We don't know. Uh, I don't know. I like that other store. It's stocked. All right, so they have pops in the regular toy aisle. And, ah, modular Iron Man. So we got him sitting there, nothing else. And SPD Blue Rangers. I'll scan it to see if it's on sale, because I know, uh, Young OG was looking for that. And uh, nothing new there. So let's take this to scan. Oh, here's a new GI Joe. And what do we got? Ric Flair and Stone Cold. Very nice to see. And top picks, all top picks, no AEW. That's a shame. No Star Wars either. No luck. And Skella God, Moss Man. Bam, more of these guys. Bam, that's brand new. Look at that. And the Land Shark. Cool. Uh, nope. So we're back at Walmart. They did do a whole new planogram here because these shelves were not here before, but Blur, Black Arachnia is here. Asher's checking out his Roblox, which they have Series 9 and Series 7 down there. Alien and Predator are down there. This looks like G.I. Joe retro figures, but none of the new Snake Eye stuff. G.I. Joe Classified will go there. And we have Spider-Man movie figures, Power Rangers, Legends, 2288, Legends Villains, that's fine. So they're prepared for stock. Maybe they got stock in and then I just didn't, I wasn't here early enough. Here's the Meowskulls two pack, but that's three and three quarter. Uh, that's Pokemon. Look at this. There's Riddle and AJ. Wow, look at that Riddle. That's wild. Man, that's a good looking Seth that they made right there. Kofi, no elites. Oh my God, still nothing here. All right. What's up guys, how's it going? Awesome week again. Another fantastic wrestling figures pickup apparently because I've just been getting extremely lucky finding some AEW figures, WWE figures. I'm just ec ecstatic to the fact that I'm able to go hunt and actually find figures that you don't necessarily need but you want and you really want it so that's why i'm actually just happy that i was able to see them in stores on the pegs and i'm able to pick them up happy just happy we all know that feeling and I, it's a great feeling when you're you actually go and find something that you actually want so we have a lot going on um a lot of things going on this week too so uh yeah i've been all all about uh, especially in new jersey i'm gonna go to new jersey next week it's gonna be crazy um wearing this new storm shadow t-shirt uh if you don't know where i got this please check out the video that i had previously where um the nerds of color was gracious enough to 
gift me this uh, this apparel by Steve Aoki's Dim Mac Fashion Collection. So this is really cool to have this representing this whole Dim Mac uh, Snake Eyes movie, which I still have to see the movie. I still have to see the movie. It's crazy. Um, so Keith Chow, if you're watching, maybe. Uh, thank you so much. This means a whole lot to me. Uh, Steve Aoki, awesome. This is really cool. Uh, first, we're going to go over everything from the haul, which is pretty crazy because I did get a bit. Uh, I got two packages also. Um, also, if you saw that little clip that I had with the Flyers, Community Caravan, if you guys know what that is, that's from my from the Philadelphia area. They they kind of visit different neighborhoods and they have this whole like parade of everything and so many um, the, like the cheerleaders, the cheer squads there. Uh, so they just throw out all this swag stuff. So it was nuts. Um, it was a lot of fun for me and the kids. Got a Flyers bandana uh, and a pair of flip-flops. Flyers flip-flops. These things are like seriously heavy-duty stuff. These are some strong flip-flops. These aren't like those $2 flip-flops from Old Navy. This is crazy. So that ex is extremely nice uh, to get that stuff. Uh, so what do we do first? Um, you know what? It's crazy. You know, I got, I got to show you this because so at Target, uh, Target, as you guys are more than likely, you guys know that I, I look at Roblox stuff for my for my son. Um, they came out with these new things right here. Uh, this is a whole new package. Look, as it can say, series one. They decided to do. Build the figures. Look at this. Collect all this, build that. Collect all that, build that. Oh, God. So when he saw this, it was like, now, which one do you want to build? We got to go find them all. It's crazy. So we're going to be collecting stuff. Oh, it's, it's endless. Roblox is endless. At least it's only one thing that he collects. Just one. And Roblox is it. So it's not a variety like like daddy here. It's just he's got that one thing and he's focused on it. So yeah, that's that. Uh, let's continue. So my one Walmart pickup uh, was Carrying Cross. Had to pick up Carrying Cross. Awesome looking figure. First time in the line too. That's awesome that this is the first time in the line. Because I thought he had a basic figure. But I could be wrong. Could definitely be wrong. This is actually a cloth goods jacket right there. So that's really awesome. Still looking for Becky. Would love to get Becky. Maybe Alistair. I'm not too sure. Because I've had... Uh, I, I don't need it. But then again, if they have AEW Malachi, then yo, that's, that's one to pick up. But this is cool. Here is beautiful carrying cross right there. Uh, Target? Should we go with Target? No, let's not do Target. We'll do Target last because you guys kind of saw what I had at Target. Uh, we have here a mail call. Boom, small box. This is from Foosh. This is Articulated Icons. He had quite the sale going on. Uh, so really awesome. And I did pick up two Articulated Icons because I've never had them before. This is my first time trying them out. And for, I think, 12 bucks, I figured, what the hell? Why not? I'm going to try these out, see what they're like. And plus, they're ninjas. I can work with ninjas in, any, in, in some kind of form for photography. So I bought the blue ones. There's the blue. Oh, jeez. There is the blue, kind of blue, cobalt blue, maybe? Uh, it varies. But it's got these it's variety of accessories, so I'm actually happy with that. Uh, I've been told they are just maybe a hair smaller than Legends, but they can fit in with the Legends. So uh, I'm, I'm still excited over it. These look awesome. Uh, but for 12 bucks, I couldn't pass this up. So if you guys have articulated icons... Which ones do you have? And do you actually like them? So, Clan of Dusk Ninja. That's what these are called. Clan of Dusk Ninja. But, 
Really cool. Really, really cool to have those. Oh, why are you falling? Uh, what's next? Ah, really, really cool one. Um, this one. This one's going to be nice. This one's from Bluefin, Bandai Namco. So, I already cut the box. And this was from the... Comic-Con pre-orders. So it came in, which uh, they did expect to ship them in August. So I was actually happy that they actually shipped uh, actually pretty early. So here it is. Yes. Beautiful. I got the 2021 exclusive Golden Axe Skeleton Pack. So there is that. This is really cool. This is really small box. That's a small box, but there's two figures in here, two, two of the skeleton figures. So let's take a look, see how they look. So I know there's been a variety of these figures of different colors. There's the original white ones. There's uh, pink ones. I think there are pink ones. Uh, and then there's these like grayish like dirty blackish looking ones and they look really really good very nice I don't know if you can really make that out but I'll probably open them and show them to you guys next time but they come with these shields and swords uh, so that's what they look like so not bad these will be fun these will be really fun to work with because I'll Probably use them with Surtur, so we'll see. Uh, Lady Death, Mythic Legions, they're all going to work out. So that's that's the whole point. Get get some use and some photography with these pictures right there. So that's awesome. Got, got some new Storm Collectibles. That's really cool. So let's do Target. Target, crazy, right? Uh, so for one... We got our modular Iron Man. Very nice. Looks great. Extremely happy to have this version of Iron Man because, you know, this this was childhood, honestly. This was childhood right here. Uh, I was extremely upset when I actually looked at the stealth suit Iron Man. Oh, my God. So that basically was someone returning the figure. I don't know what the hell they did with it. So, of course, the blast effects were missing. And that white residue thing that every, all the like reviewers were talking about, it, it was all over it. But at the same time, the, uh, the crotch was broken. It was just like snapped. Uh, so I was just really, really upset. I was like, oh, can't buy it, unfortunately. So I had to just leave it behind. Uh, I let the staff member know. Who knows what they could have done with it. Uh, so, still got Modular Iron Man. I will still be on the hunt for Ultron, the Hologram, the Vault Guardsman, and of course, Stealth Suit Iron Man. But I'm going to take my time with it because uh, there is a lot of pre-orders that I've got to fulfill. So, that should be coming up uh, shortly and hopefully we can take care of that. Uh, modular Iron Man. Then, the restock of, of when I turned the corner. So I did pick up a few of them. I picked up Kenny Omega. This is my first Kenny Omega figure. I remember seeing the Series 1 back at Walmart. That was the only time I really ever saw AEW, Series 1. Uh, and I remember how they looked. And they were just really pale. And sometimes the face was always off. Like the paint apps on the face was off on the sculpt. So I didn't pick any of them up. Uh, but this one, this one looked good. I'm actually happy with this one. This one looks great. So I got my first Kenny Omega figure. Uh, I did get Sammy to go with my Chris Jericho. So that's awesome. Uh, I, I always thought, but now I see it. Because I always thought that one of the cards was hit me up. Uh, based on a lot of the packaging. But he's got several cards in there. So it's probably just... You know how it get got 
manufactured and placed in the box. So this is cool. I wish he did come with an alternate head sculpt. I, I really did. I mean, the head sculpt is perfectly fine for him just because of him. But that's Sammy for you. So I'm actually happy with that. And I did get Cody. So this Cody, two different head sculpts. Awesome. Now this head sculpt does definitely remind me of Series 1 head sculpt. Uh, but this is cool. Uh, I love the the attire that he's got. Uh, he's got soft goods for for his shirt. So that's really awesome. And I know there's a chase of this one. So was hoping. Was really hoping. But that's cool. Uh, I did not get Santana or Ortiz. And I just realized I have four out of Series 4. So that's, that's wild. So that's awesome. Got Cody. And that was the pickups for Target. But it's not over. Because... My wife did a pickup. My wife did a pickup. It was crazy. Uh, she, I was sleeping because I do work at night. And she texted me, woke me up, texted me. It's like, hey, this is what I found. And she texted me these pictures. And I'm like, <laughs> oh. It's like, yeah, I need them. If you can buy them, please just bring them home. She said, okay, great. And... She brought them home. There they are. There they are. Really, the only two that I wanted from this wave. Granted, would have been nice to have the chase. Would have been nice to have the... There's a limited figure of this one, too. So, we got Darby Allen with the TNT belt. That thing is awesome. So, that's really really nice i had the opportunity to buy the other darby which was i think like series two or series three but i passed because i knew this one was going to be coming out and this is the new unmatched collection so i'm actually happy that this she found this this is unbelievable and of course Britt baker dmd there you go uh i after looking at her head sculpt it's it's they did do a good job with it. I think it could be a little bit better. Maybe it's the size of her head on this. Uh, because we all know that, you know, these these plastic jackets can make the figure look really, really big. That's, that's the only problem with it. Plus, she's got these huge boots. It really looks weird. It looks off. It really does. I'm just happy, though. It's a Britt Baker figure. Um, the face sculpt does in hand look better. Uh, it, it does work, but I'm actually still just happy. Got these two, the two that I wanted from the unmatched collection. So there, now you have it. I am, that's nuts for, for one week of AEW. God damn. That's a lot. Well, there you have it guys. That should be all it's it's every week man it's every week so let me guys let me uh, let me know what you guys have been finding it's been a crazy week hope you had a good one hope you were able to find what you've been finding we have all these new planograms set up at all the stores setting up all the new the new peg hooks signage all the new stuff is being put out so hopefully you guys were able to find some things thank you guys so much for watching like comment subscribe always appreciate it Thank you again. Hope to hear from you soon. Hope to see you on the next hunt.